giving each other a Pokemon category, and both of us have to catch a Pokemon within it. First person to catch five correct Pokemon wins. John, your category is bird Pokemon. <laughs> Come on. Your category is cave Pokemon. Oh, Heck. What is the most bird, bird Pokemon in existence? This is the question. There's like some very famous cave Pokemon. And what if that's, what if that's just the bat Pokemon? <laughs> Stay with me. The most bird, bird Pokemon. And the first one I think of, I cross off the list. But the second one that no one cares about, that's the winner. Trying to catch mine now. Aha! The most bird looking bird Pokemon. Oh, that was easy. All right. I'm rethinking a lot of things as I, oh, I caught it. <laughs> <laughs> I don't feel super confident about this, but I caught Golbat. So, so, so far away. Uh, this one was mean. It was either Gabite or Drudagon. Uh... <laughs> I thought about all of the birds and the bird world and i decided that spiro is the most birdly bird you were close buddy it was pidgeotto or pidgeot i looked at pidgeotto and i oh no damn it oh. all right john your next pokemon is going to be the water fish pokemon as opposed to the sky fish or the lava fish <laughs> your category is the sphere pokemon oh my god so a fish that's within the water what are the balls Wait, no, the Pokemon is floating above the water in battle. What is happening? My world is caving in on itself. Okay, I caught mine. I have caught a fish. Go ahead and tell me what you think it was, John. Was it Goldeen? It was Wooper or Quagsire. What now? Wooper and Quagsire. One more time. Wooper mm -hmm. and Quagsire. Okay. Is it Voltorb? Is it of the Hisuian variety? Yeah, that's the only one I knew how to get. Ah, uh, yeah, then you got it. Yes! If you had said... Regular Voltorb, that is the ball Pokemon. Oh my god! Hi, Mr. Texas Man in hot weather. I want you to find the fresh snow Pokemon. All right, John, yours is the Royal Air Pokemon. Oh, I love that. But I have no idea what it is. Did you say like the air? Like air to the throne? Yes, H-E-I-R. There's the stupid fish Pokemon that are in the water walking <laughs> around, boop -a doop -a doop It's gotta be Snow Run, right? I have an idea. It's not Litleo, because it's not in any of the games. And Litleo is a king of things. And wanna know what else they talk about always being a king of animals? They talk about T-Rexes. Why am I thinking T-Rexes? Because Jurassic Park comes out soon. You know, John, the only Jurassic Park movies I've seen, uh, the first one I ever saw was actually Jurassic World. So you don't just randomly go, do, 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 just for no reason. I've been doing it with like, da, 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 da. Oh. One know what's stuck in my head? The theme for Raid Shadow Legends, the sponsor of today's video. Raid Shadow Legends is a turn-based game, free to play on mobile or PC, with over 600 champions you can collect and use in various fun game modes. Last year, Raid even introduced a brand new faction of the game called the Shadowkin, and they've quickly become my absolute favorite. And right now, the Path of Light event and the Deliana Chase event are live in Raid. As long as you log in seven days between now and July 20th, you will get the legendary champion Deliana for free and if you enter promo code my Deliana in game you will also get 50 XP brew so what are you waiting for if you use my link or scan the QR code on screen here new players will get a free champion Tyrell 200k silver one XP boost one energy refill and one ancient shard you will find these rewards here in your inbox for the next 30 days only all right I got it success all right what did you catch I stuck to what I thought it was I uh I got snow run it was a snow cone Mikey it was Manilish. In spirit, I got Litleo, but since it doesn't exist in these games, I got Tyron. You got it. Yeah! Let's go! As soon as you said T-Rex, I was like, oh, man. I'm also realizing its name is Tyron, like tyrannical leader. Tyrannosaurus Rex literally means, like, king of the lizards. I'm the f lizard king. All right, John, your next Pokemon is the Mystic Pokemon. Ooh. All right, your Pokemon is the Scout Pokemon. Scout. I am staring at a, a Pokemon, and I'm waiting for it to do something mystical. I'm just flying around while I think. Do something! I found a shiny! What? I was just flying around, and that's a random shiny Luxray. You're subscribed to the, the PM7 channel, of course, right, Mikey? Uh, yeah, of course I do. You know what they say? You're subscribed to the channel, you find shinies. You watch the videos, you find shinies. You're in the videos, you find shinies. Subscribe today. If I catch this, does it, does it count as my like my guess or can i catch it and move on nah you're subscribed to the channel this one's on the house all right sweet thank you i found a pokemon it was mystical and then you found a shiny the stars are aligning 
All right, scout Pokemon. Wait, I have an idea. Ah, there was one immediately. Viva Las Vegas. All right, John, what Pokemon did you catch? Not the most sound logic, but it was looking mystical in the sky, so I got Zatu. Oh, you got it. It was Zatu or Flygon. Wow, what? I got Ninkata. It was either gonna be Growlithe or Sentret because Pat Rat is not in any of the games. It's the trainee Pokemon. That's like the same thing. Mikey, I need you to find a Ruffian Pokemon. Yours is the Big Rock Pokemon. That's a wrestler. I don't, <laughs> what are you talking about? It's not just a boulder. It's about drive, it's about power. We stay hungry. Wait, I think I might know what it is. You know how sometimes you mess up and then uh, going to, you know, do what you messed up before is like really doubling down on the mistake. Uh, Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me. Can't get fooled again. You better be a big stupid rock. I don't think it's this one. I think it's the other one. Finally. It's definitely a ruffian. Mikey, I caught Graveler the Big Rock Johnson. Sorry, John. It was Stone Jorner. Damn it. All right, well, I guess I'll just go for it. I got Carvana. Oh, it's Corfish. Why the heck is Corfish Ruffian? I think because it turns into a water dark. You had the perfect idea. Gosh dang it, Carvana's the savage Pokemon. I need you to catch a fruit Pokemon. All right, John, then yours is the happiness Pokemon. What Pokemon is truly happy? What is true happiness? Maybe that should be the question of the day. What makes you happy? Happiness is interesting because it has to be a Pokemon that has like so little going for it that they just said, eh, it has a smile. The disgusting sausage nipples are in my way. What Pokemon is happy? All right, I caught my Pokemon. I feel silly going for this Pokemon, but I know this Pokemon is not a sphere Pokemon. I also know it's not a ball Pokemon. It could just be a ball of happiness, a ball of sunshine. It puts a smile on my face, and you know what, Mikey? I think the Pokemon that is happiness incarnate is Sfeel. You're wrong. It's either Togetic or Blissey. Yeah, but Sfeel, it says it's the clap Pokemon. Clap, 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 clap. Clap your big cheeks. <laughs> All right, John, I felt pretty good about this one to the point where if I'm wrong, I'm going to be genuinely very upset. Is it Tropius? It is Tropius. Yes. Thank God. John Michael, mm. I want you to find the patient Pokemon. Yours is the electric Pokemon. Remember last time we did a video like this and I used Pokemon Snap for my reasoning and I almost got it, but I didn't get it. Today, redemption is spelled J-O-H-N. Trapinch comes to mind, but I think that's probably like the ant lion Pokemon or something with pits. I just ran into the Pokemon I was looking for on accident. This is a sign. I got this. I got this in the bag. Are you kidding me? <sighs> yeah. I have to go with a guess for a Pokemon that I'm pretty sure is not the answer, but I don't have anything else. You miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Michael Jordan. Michael Scott. Lynn Gretzky. Oh, dang. Why are you the way that you are? When you play through Pokemon Snap and you go into the electric place and you bash this guy in the head, he smacks the ground and then turns the projector back on with electricity. It's an Electabuzz. Gosh, dang it. Bzz, 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 bzz. I don't think this is it, but Galarian Stunfisk. Phenomenal guess and the logic makes sense, but it's somehow Wobbuffet. What? All right, John, your next one's gonna be the generator Pokemon. Your Pokemon is the poison pin Pokemon. I feel like I immediately know what that is. Second guessing yourself is the best way to find victory. That is not accurate. But I think generator, <laughs> like electricity, and like powering things. And Rotom goes into appliances. I want the, I see the evolved forms everywhere, but I want the base form. I went to find Rotom and it wasn't immediately where I thought it would be. So I'm feeling, I'm feeling as if I may have made a mistake. There's a male in the overworld. Here unto me, my son. But when at first you don't succeed, uh, catch an electric Pokemon that is near where Rotom is because I mean, what's the worst that could happen? I just caught my Pokemon, by the way. Wait, no, I see Rotom! What's the worst that could happen? I caught Luxray. It was next to Rotom. Rotom beat me up, but I'm sticking with Luxray. Unfortunately, good sir, the answer was either Helioptile or Heliolus. So I was close. All right, John, the poison Pin Pokemon. If it's not Nidoran male, I'm gonna cry. It's Nidoran female and male. Oh my God, John. All right, John, your next Pokemon is the Bite Pokemon. Your Pokemon is the Wily Pokemon. So it's a coyote. coyote. <laughs> 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 what are the chances? Meet me. Okay, I've thought of a Pokemon that I wanna do. I just have to remember where to get it. I know where my Pokemon is. I just also don't know where my Pokemon is. I found my Pokemon though. This Pokemon just killed mine. Am I an idiot? Speak the truth there, brother Gary. I have my Pokemon, by the way. Pop my Pokemon. I would very much like for the Wily Pokemon to be Sneasel. Oh, good guess. No, it's Nuzleaf or Impotent. Oh. 
I've learned from my past mistakes and failures and embarrassments. I've not overthought it. Dreadnought looks like it wants to bite me. Yeah, he does. So do Poochiana and Mightyena. They wouldn't hurt as bad as Dreadnought. Your Pokemon is the soft tissue Pokemon. I know that I know this, but I have zero guesses. What? Yours is the heavyweight Pokemon. Not heavy. Heavyweight. Which makes me think of box. I think of soft tissue. I think of like soft like skin so like I can poke it. It's like gelatinous. I have a guess. I I feel like it's my best guess. I don't love it. If you can poke it and it's squishy, it's a tissue. No, don't see me. I caught a Pokemon. All right, there we go. All right, John, for the heavyweight Pokemon, I caught Machamp. You really overthought it. It was it was just they were they were calling this Pokemon Tubby. It's Hippowdon. Machamp's got a belt and everything. He's a heavyweight champion. He's six Hundred pounds! Alright, Mikey, I poked this Pokemon and it was definitely a soft tissued Pokemon. Is it Gastrodon? It is Gumi or Sligoo. No, but that's also a slug. Damn it. Alright, John, your next Pokemon is the live coal Pokemon. I feel like I should know this immediately. Well, you're looking for the darkness Pokemon. Uh, it could be like any dark type. Like you said live coal, yes? Yeah. Is this a riddle? Is this a, a befuddler? Is this a trick -a -rooski? I suppose it could also be live coal. <laughs> Are you sure you want to choose the live coal Pokemon? That could work. You've spent a long time looking for the darkness. If it's not consuming you at this point, I feel like it's a wrap. Well, I was just looking for any dark type Pokemon and I finally found one. Hopefully this one's right. All right, John, I uh, this is a long shot, but is it Murkrow? What do you mean long shot? You got it right. Oh my God. It might not matter. You said live coal, yes? Yes. I legitimately in front of me have a live piece of coal. Let's Holy coley it has coal in the name and it's alive. Aha, my trick worked. Holy coley is just the coal Pokemon. The live coal Pokemon is Magby. What? There are three Pokemon made of coal and Magby is the live coal? <laughs> All right, John, yours is the flash Pokemon. Barry Allen? Or Wally West. Similar theme, different Pokemon. You're going for jet Pokemon. I think of Garchomp, but then I also think you might be tricking me. I'm stuck between a few ideas. And I don't like it. Skarmory's not the jet Pokemon. It's not fast enough. Hey, Mikey, if someone's angry at you and they attack you, do you think they're going to help you win a competition? If it's the competition of getting attacked. That decides my answer, for better or worse. Because this little fellow would never beat me up. Damn it, why are you angry at me? You're making me look like a fool. <laughs> I look like a fool often enough. I'm gonna go for it anyways. Oh, I found another shiny. <laughs> what? I was I was flying around a massive mass outbreak just while I was thinking and I found a shiny alpha duot. The kids are all saying, if you sub to the channel, you find shinies, but. Wow. That's so sick, dude. I'm so jealous of you. It's clearly a good omen, and I need to just go for the Garchomp and hope for the best. Oh, I don't like you saying it's a good omen. I'm going to go catch a Pokemon. Greetings, large man. I did not say the large man Pokemon. Oh, brother, this guy. Aha, okay, finally. Michael of the seventh realm, what did you capture? Well, first I got this really cool shiny alpha duot. But then after that, I caught, I caught, I caught the Garchomp. I was, I, was, I, was, uh, I was pretty open about the Garchomp. I got good news and I got bad news. Oh. The bad news is obviously that you didn't get the jet Pokemon. The good news, you got the coolest shiny I've seen anyone get in one of my videos. Yeah. The jet Pokemon is Octillery or Remoraid. What? I don't know. I've had to like quadruple jet to make sure I'm not lying. Water jet and ink jet. What is this, a freaking printer? I was gonna go for its evolve form. It beat me up. You said nay. So I went with Shinx. Oh. Wait, really? Yeah, you got it. No way. But who's the real winner here? Look at my duot. <laughs> 